One of the best parts of my job is that I get to visit with students or people who are going to become students on a regular basis. And they're talking about how they can take their dreams and turn them into reality. And one of the biggest challenges that people run into is how in the world am I going to pay for college? And that's a fair question. Money. It is a factor in a lot of the decisions we make and college is not cheap. But let's talk about some of the things that we do at Southeast Arkansas College and, and some ways that we can package different options for you to make college possible. First off, let's look at this Southeast Arkansas College in general. We have one of the lowest cost of attendance of any school in the state. In some cases, we are a third to a half the cost of other colleges. And we work hard to make that possible because we know that for very few students, can they just write a check and pay for all of their, their tuition and fees. And so we want to make that possible. But let's talk about what those include. And we talked about tuition and fees, and that's the cost per class that you're going to pay. And that's usually the largest part of a college education is actually paying for the classes. The second component that a lot of people don't think about, but it is very real, is the cost of textbooks. For some students, this could be several hundred dollars. And in fact, our average college student pays $1,300. But wait, that was $1,300 before this semester. We're doing something new at CR, and you're going to hear a lot more information about it. But we've partnered with our Barnes & Noble bookstore and Cengage Unlimited to offer for the first time essentially a digital subscription service that you can get all of your textbooks for a single low fee. In fact, it's $119 a semester for all of our Cengage books. Now, not all of our books are Cengage, but we have a lot of them that are. And so our students are going to save a tremendous amount of money moving forward. But the fact is, there's still cost. So let's talk about some of the things that you can do to put together that package to try to make it better. The first thing you need to do is complete the free application for federal student aid, also known as the FAFSA. Now the FAFSA is a free application online and you can actually see the, the website link right there. And that link will allow you to apply for aid and you can get two kinds of aid. You can get grants or you can get loans. So let's talk about grants right now. One of the most common ones is a Pell Grant, which is free money provided by the federal government that you do not have to pay back. And almost 70% of our students qualify for a full Pell. Well, a full Pell covers all of the cost of the college. In fact, a lot of our students actually will get a refund every semester in which we give that money back because it exceeds what was necessary. The second thing that you need to do is after you apply for financial aid and find out if you have grant eligibility, is that you then need to complete the state aid. And you need to go to the ADHE's Challenge Scholarship website. And again, there's the link there. And that link will allow you to apply for the lottery scholarship and several other aid options that they've got. Now, they are very date dependent and some of those deadlines may have already passed, but you should go ahead and apply because sometimes they do second disbursements and sometimes you just need to get into the, the system to help your chances of getting that aid future terms better. So now you, you, you put these together. Again, we're putting that package together. And the institution also has scholarships. If you go to crc.edu backslash scholarship, you can uh, apply for an institutional award that, again, is money that you can use in order to go to college and to pick up some of that needed aid for your education. So you, you put together that, and again, if you still got some left, you may want to look at third-party awards. And there's a lot of state agencies that provide uh, grants uh, that also provide incentives to go back to college. You know what, a common one is uh, rehabilitation services. Another one is the VA, if you qualify for any of those. Again, you can take that money and apply it towards your bill trying to get it taken care of. You can also talk to local service groups, community service foundations, uh, churches, all kinds of sources for uh, financial support can be found for students that make a real difference. Another option that you may have is, and this one's a little bit different than any we've talked about, is the idea that you may want to take a student loan. Now, I do not recommend student loans except if it is the only option that you've got. 
But I will tell you this, I do not know of a better investment than an investment in oneself to make their future possible. And that is really what a, lo a student loan does. And so as part of that financial aid package that you've already filled out, you'll find out if you're eligible for loans. And you can find out what you need. Now, try to keep it as minimal as possible, but you can figure out how to pay. So the last area, and that's if everything else is stacked up and we've packaged everything together and you still have a bill, we have the ability to set up a payment plan. You can put down as little as 20% and then set up payments for the remainder of the semester to pay off that debt and it makes it smaller, bite size uh, payments that you make each time or each, uh, each interval that you set up with the payment plan. Hopefully, why well, once you apply for FAFSA and once you apply for the state aid and the institutional aid and you look for third parties and then you consider loans or maybe a payment plan with all of those things together, it makes it possible to cover the money. But here's the thing, however you piece it together, one, know we're here to help you. Anytime, come by, visit with our Office of Financial Aid, visit with our student advisors. But more importantly, just get started. Come visit us. We hope you'll be a student at CR College.